Okay folks, back to the quick, quick tip format. Let me take a minute to show you about menu customizations in Fusion 360. Let's start with getting rid of menus. No, I didn't just will that off screen. I used a keyboard shortcut. On a Mac, it's Option Command A. For those using Windows, here's how to find that same menu. Next, I'll bring up my extrude dialog. This is in the default location and size, but I want to change both. To resize, I'll move my mouse over the corner until the cursor changes as such. Then, left click and drag to adjust the width. To move it off the side, I'll left click and hold on the gray portion at the top and move my mouse to my liking. Once it's off the side anchor, you can resize this using the lower right corner. Wait until your cursor shows this. But now, I want to re-anchor to the side. Left clicking and dragging the same gray matter, I'll move my mouse cursor to the side until the green bar indicates it'll reattach. Now all that's left to do is let go of the mouse button. The browser will operate in the same manner, but the toolbar will require that I click and drag from the leftmost handle. Now that I've thoroughly destroyed the interface, let's reset it. To do this, I'll use the same view dropdown I showed earlier, then select Reset to Default Layout. In addition, some menus like the Sketch Palette will allow you to temporarily hide them by selecting the double arrows in the upper right hand corner. What's neat about this is that if you want to access those constraints and options, you can hover over the shortcut and all will be revealed for easy access. Finally, going along with the menu window customization, you can also do the same with the toolbar. And sometimes this can happen on accident, like when you click and hold rather than click. That's what I've done with the Attach Canvas button here. And Join. And Press Pull. But never fear, another reset is available. Just right mouse click in the void, and you'll find an option to reset all toolbar customizations. And everything is back to normal. Hope that helps.